Monday the 19th of December 2022. Welcome and along to the James Neal Cooper Show episode 2 million and 42. And what's happening today? Well, first of all, I'm taking recommendations from a company that works with YouTube called vidIQ, which I have done before. And this is what they recommend for me to do. You can see in the picture here, free gorges, dam collapse, Free exploring free gorges failures there's free gorges damn local video and something from china insights and spotlight on china so being a stubborn person i thought i'd do something completely different and what is actually happening at the free gorges dam first of all we can go to the satellite images and this is the most recent one from the 18th of december sunday yesterday it was and you can see it's like it was before it feels like it's really cold and there's lots of frozen parts of it. Now, we can go back in time so we can compare, but the title of this, is there any power being generated? Because we can't see any wake from the generators either side of the sluice gates, which are right in the middle. So we can go back in time to October and nothing much there. You can see similar, but less frost and ice. And even going back a bit further in time, not too sure, a little bit of cloud there. I think this was in, I think this was in August of 2022, but you can see some of the wake on the locks on the right, top right hand side. But if we go back even further this year, this is May. 2022 and you can see that this both the generator sides of the dam are actually working there is quite a big wake and the water levels i can't remember what it was at that time so that's when it was working but going back to now it seems like there's very little energy being produced at all there are some reports that six or seven turbines are working out of the 34 and it's producing maybe like 20 percent electricity which is tiny considering it's meant to power for 10 million 100 million people i would say it's under a million people if there is any energy coming out of it the levels are like this as of today now it is all in chinese but you can see third from the bottom you can see the levels of the reservoir 158.50 which says it's gone up red means it's gone up green means it's gone down there is no inflow but there is an outflow of 6100 and something and with that let's have a look at the weather forecast for central china for the next couple of days Related to the infamous webcam, it is still once again down or still is down. I actually have DM'd them a direct message on their Twitter feed to the Free Gorgeous Corporation saying, when is the webcam going to be up? But surprise, surprise, what they have done is nothing. Haven't responded, absolutely nothing. Not that they're going to get many messages, but I thought there'd be the common decency to do this. You'll find this quite often with the uh, Free Gorgeous Corporation or even the Chinese government. If it's something they don't want to do, they just don't respond, which is actually incredibly annoying. Now, related to the other parts of the title, uh, here you can see the backside of the Free Gorgeous Dam, and this is the water storage side. And did you know 
there are 69 holes on the backside of the dam, which is quite interesting. And regular spillways control the flow, and there are 22 holes for draining mud and, you could say, the garbage. And if you look closely on the right-hand side, you can see one of these holes. But at the moment, the levels are so low that um, the garbage, so to speak, can't get there. Yeah. At the top, there are 22 crest gates that allow the water to flow naturally when the um, dam is full, which hasn't actually happened this year. And there are additional two holes on the left and right for discharging such things like driftwood, refrigerators, <laughs> anything that's someone thrown basically into the Yangtze River. So that's new enough the latest what we got of the Free Gorge Dam for you for today. But before we move on, this I think is the first time ever since the completion of the Free Gorge Dam that the spillways, the sluice gates haven't been open because of the really low water levels. At the beginning of 2022, we were quite concerned that the water levels hadn't gone down. And you said, what is the problem? Is there something to do with maintenance, etc.? They have repaired the ship's elevators, according to the Free Gorges Corporation this year. But because the levels have been so low because of the drought, basically, of 2022, then the spillway gates haven't been open. We were expecting them to open in April and May because the water levels, again, were so high when they should have been about 10 meters lower but eventually the water came out through generating electricity and as we saw a little bit earlier in the ship's locks and the ship's elevators they were discharging water that way instead of using the very expensive spillway gates or the floodgates so all very interesting What's going to happen for the remainder of the year? Well, to be honest, I'm going to say pretty much nothing. There's not going to be much water. You saw on the weather forecast that there was a pitter-patter of rain, but nothing to write home about. And what's going to happen, usually they got to get the water levels down before March, April time to 145, which is not going to be difficult this year because it's already at 158. Usually it would be now about 168. The sluice gates wouldn't be operating. They only seem to operate when it gets into the 170s or if there's a sudden increase of water coming from upstream of the reservoir itself. Whew. Let's take a break. Now, usually at the end, I promote a, another channel of mine. Um, usually, again, it's the Tokyo and Pickle channel, my two beautiful rescue cats. Tokyo now is about three and a half, and Pickle, the little kitten, very playful, very excited kitten, is like three months, about getting three months. So September, October, November, getting close to four months, actually. But today I want to show you a video of, or a part of a video that you can see on the We Travel channel, the link is in the description below, when I ventured out at night time in Pattaya, the adult playground, um, earlier this year. In fact, it was at the beginning of November. Here's a small snippet for you, but you can see the full show on the We Travel. It goes like this.
have a most awesome day. I hope that a lot of your Christmas shopping is done and you're ready for the big weekend, the Christmas weekend in five, well, five or six days time. If you do want to give me a present, well, that's fine. Just send me something on Amazon. That'd be absolutely fantastic. I'll put my email address below and like, subscribe and share super chat. No, super thanks is available by hitting the uh, just hitting the link below. You can join the channel. You can be one of the exclusive members to this channel by clicking the join button. And hopefully, God willing, I will see you tomorrow. My name is James. Bye bye for now. Thank you.